In this video, I'm going to show you how to bench test a leak detection pump. We may ask you to perform this test when working to diagnose a hard-to-find evaporative emission system leak. This test will help you to confirm the leak detection pump is not at fault and is sealing the system during the evaporative monitor test. To perform this test, you will need a constant source of 21 inches of vacuum. Connecting a vacuum hose to a running engine will work. Be sure vehicle exhaust is properly vented. A set of fused jumper leads to connect the LDP, a 12 volt switchable power source to activate the solenoid, a latex balloon that fits tight over the canister side of the LDP. First remove the LDP from the problem vehicle. Follow manufacturer's repair instructions for removal. Place LDP on bench or mount in vise for testing. Be careful when mounting, it is made of plastic. Connect the fused jumper leads to the LDP connector. Use a wiring diagram to determine the 12 volt circuit and switched ground. During testing, I will have a constant ground connected to the LDP and switch the 12 volt side. Connect a constant vacuum source to the LDP. Place a balloon over the canister side of the LDP. Be sure the vent opening is open and clear of obstructions. Toggle your 12 volt circuit to the pump. The balloon will begin to inflate. Continue to cycle the solenoid until the balloon stops inflating. Once the balloon is inflated, it should remain inflated until you manually deflate. If balloon doesn't hold pressure, the LDP is faulty and not sealing correctly. To confirm the connection at the balloon is sealed, spray with soapy water. 